Some huge news just dropped today for Netflix's Avatar The Last Airbender live action. Which is uh, very interesting to say the least because a Spider-Man trailer is dropping today and by default that will take away from the announcement. But who cares, it's here and let's cover it. Now before I begin this video I just want to say this is a weird upload time for me because I'm trying to get the news out as fast as possible. So please leave a like, it'll help the video reach my normal audience. Also a while back I said I was going to do a giveaway of the new Avatar The Last Airbender Blu-rays that came out. So I made a Twitter for that, it is the avatarist with an A. I'll have a link in the description and a pinned comment. Okay, now let's get into it. Here is the full cast. Please forgive my awful pronunciation as I am not from any of the countries that these names are from. Uncle Iroh is played by Paul Sun Young Lee. Monkeyazo is played by Lim K Su. So far, just off of these two characters alone, this is great. Even without the costumes, they look very similar to the characters in the show. Ken Leong is Commander Zhao. Now, these are big shoes to fill here. Zhao is one of my favorite characters and all of his his lines are so intense. I'm really excited to see how he does. Daniel Day Kim is the big bad Fire Lord Ozai. Of course, here's our main cast that we already know. Daniel Cormier. Oh my god, I said Daniel Cormier. I watch way too much MMA. We have Gordon Cormier for Aang. I'm so sorry. I cannot pronounce Katara's name. I don't want to butcher it, so I'm not even going to try. But here is how her name is spelled. We have Ian Owsley for Sokka. And of course, Dallas Liu for Zuko. Now, I'm going to be honest. I don't understand any of the hate for this main cast i think they could all do well and i'm gonna say it i've said it many times i think they all look like the characters here's a picture of our main cast together on set i've heard they're all huge fans of the series so i have faith that this will be good also i've seen a lot of particular hate for Zuko, uh, and if you're not sure about Zuko, just look at him next to his father in the show. They look good together. Like they look like their father and son, and they. I don't know, they look like Ozai and Zuko. I'm a, I'm a fan here. This is a good fit. Avatar The Last Airbender is filming in a new custom-built facility featuring 23,000 square foot virtual production volume. The same generation technology used on Disney Plus's The Mandalorian. Now, this tweet right here by Avatar News, this made me feel a lot better about the show. This shows that they're putting money into this, that the special effects is gonna look nice. That is at least the positive. Say everything else goes bad, at least the special effects will look Look nice and the characters will look accurate so at the very very worst we're going to get a product many many times better than the last live action which is good enough for me all right that's all the news we have for today be sure to follow my twitter for updates and uh giveaways yeah that's it until next time <laughs>